Here's how to do a neon effect in CapCut. Now, if you wanted to add a neon or glow effect in CapCut, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Let's open up CapCut and tap on new project here. I'm gonna tap on stock videos and I'm just gonna choose a random stock video to add. Now that I've done that, I'm gonna tap on effects at the very bottom and video effects. Now on here, I'm gonna type in neon and hit search and I'm gonna do neon outline. So you can see I can adjust it depending on the intensity, but let's keep it at max right now and hit the check mark. So you can see it has a really cool neon outline. Let's scroll this to the very end of this video, delete the little outro. So now what we're gonna do is essentially save this to our gallery. Let's hit the export button at the top, right? And we're gonna save it to our gallery. And then essentially what we're gonna do, let's hit done, new project. I'm gonna go over to that same stock video and add it, the original one. And now I'm gonna tap overlay at the very bottom, add overlay and add this one with the neon glow. Now I'm gonna zoom out a bit. So basically it covers this entire screen. And now I am gonna do a blend. Let's tap on blend at the very bottom and let's go over and do say hard. We can choose different ones depending on what we like here. So let's switch over to overlay, see how that looks as well. That is pretty cool. So let's just do something like that, like an overlay like that. And you can see it as this neon glow. Let's change, let's go back here and tap on the original clip. And let's go to, sorry, go back here, all the way back and tap on effects again and video effects. And we're gonna add an edge glow. So type in edge glow. And there it is, tap on that and we will adjust that and let's do a bit more glow here and hit the check mark. So you can see, I'm gonna expand this out to the full video as well. So you can see basically it allows me to the, do this kind of edge glow. However, I wanna do a couple other things. Let's tap on the video here or just go back and tap on the overlay. And in the overlay, let's swipe over and tap on cutout. And then we're gonna hit remove background because I don't want it to basically do that for the entire background. I just want to do this for the specific person. So let's hit turn off cutout and hit remove background. And that looks pretty good. Now, another cool thing that I can do is make that neon glow kind of expand over time. So let's tap the original video and tap a keyframe. And then let's scroll over a bit and we'll tap on that edge glow and we'll add a new keyframe on here and we'll expand it out a bit. So let's expand it so that it looks like that glow effect is kind of moving out. And then I'm gonna scroll forward a little bit, add another one and I'm gonna scroll it out even more. So now you can see if I, oh, let's add the original one and keep it back down to center. So now I hit play and you can see it has that cool neon effect to it. And then it starts to expand it out and expand it out even more. And of course you can do any other animations, any other effects with that, but that's essentially how you do that neon glow. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.